good morning students and friends i am dr m sandil kumar now we'll say about another important uh, topic under the subject engineering graphics the isometric projections isometric projection in the orthographic projection that is in the multi view projection more than one view is needed to describe a solid okay you recall the orthographic projection of a cylinder okay the cylinder is seen as a circle in top view and a, a rectangle as front view okay so multiple views needed to describe a solid so the understanding and visualization of particulars about the solid is difficult under orthographic projection if the same solid is tilted both with respect to hp and vp then the resultant view will show the three dimensional of the solid so that the shape of the solid can more clearly be visualized such a kind of drawing that gives overall shape and size of the solid in one view is called pictorial projection isometric projection is a type of pictorial projection the other pictorial projections are diametric trimetric oblique and perspective as per the university syllabus you have isometric projection and perspective projection in the syllabus isometric is taken from the greek word which means equal measure isos means equal metron means measure hence these two words are combined into a single word called isometric under the projection uh, there are two major div uh, 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 divisions one orthographic another one pictorial okay under pictorial again there are three types axonometric oblique and perspective under axonometric there are uh, three types one isometric trimetric dimetric okay you have isometric uh, in the syllabus of course perspective is also there in the syllabus that we will see it in the next chapter so this chapter deals with isometric you see isometric the viewing angle is equal to the three major planes or three major axes that is the alpha beta gamma all are equal to 120 that is why since all are all the angles are equal the observer is position such that all the the angle between the three major faces of the observer is equal equal to 120 that is why it is called isometric projection uh, in diametric projection two angles are equal uh, other third angle will be different that is why it is called diametric trimetric all three angles are not equal that is trimetric okay so we'll see the isometric now before that we'll see about the other things also diametric projection in the case of diametric projection two planes are equally shortened and the two axes are equally inclined trimetric in the case of trimetric projection all the three planes are unequally shortened and three axes are unequally inclined okay so isometric this is how the isometric uh, projection of an object looks if the same object is uh, 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 viewed by diametric this is how it looks under trimetric this is the view under oblique this is the view perspective uh, it is a definite projection uh, it is other pictorial kind of a pictorial projection it looks like this